Hey guys, and welcome back to Silent Hill 4. When we last left off, we finally made it out of um, uh, the water prison for the second time. Now, I'm not sure where we're going now, but let's make sure we're at least somewhat prepared. Uh, I don't think we're going to want that. Let's drop that back. Oh, that one is slightly cracked. Okay, anti-spirit. We've got two of those left. We did leave one of those impaled. So, I mean, we can still knock down a few ghosts. How much health we got? We've got two of those. We've got one of those. We've got five of those. Okay, so health, you know, we're bound to find a few more bits and pieces. So we're not in a terrible situation health-wise. Now, we're going to want some bullets. We've actually actually got a few bullets, which ain't too bad either. Anyway, let's go back and find our friend Eileen. Let's go back and rejoin her. Let's get the fuck out of here. Yeah, we're going to enter the hall. We like entering holes around here. And I don't have my drink. God damn it, you fool! So, where are we going next? See if we're going to be hospital world, apartment world, maybe building world. Let's go have a little look. Oh, I wonder if we're going to get fucking ambushed by Walter Sullivan. Fucking Mr. Creeper. Wearing that anorak like raincoat, like a pervert. <sighs> well... Yes, we're ready as we're ever going to be. Where to? Who's that? I guess we're back in building world. Oh! Is that Richard? Maybe we should have brought a sword of obedience. Is he going to be like stalking us throughout the entirety of this? If so, that... Oh, fuck. Okay. Oh, hello. That would suck. Well, we're going to take the drinks. Kind of nice. Oh. Oh. Oh, fuck. Um... Um, 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 um. Are you like teleports? Ow, dude. Dude, this, this guy sucks. He's doing loads of damage to us as well. Oh, shit. Okay. I remember this place. Not. It looks a lot like downtown. A fan of him. Is he like gone gone now? <sighs> it's a diary. I want to go back to that time. Things were so good then. The day of my birthday, the cute cat in the pet store. All of those balls in the basket. Playing pool was fun too. The door of time was wide open. When I see four things, I can't help but remember that time. So I guess we need to find four things. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, can we go back? Yeah, I think we can. We're using the silver bullet on him, and we're putting him down. Man, that dude is fucking annoying. Is that Richard, though? Right, you stay here, Eileen. We're gonna go get a silver bullet and a sword of obedience. That guy sucks! He's like teleporting all over the place, does loads of damage. Yeah, not a fan of him. And I'm guessing he's gonna be following us everywhere as well. 
This is unacceptable. Look how much damage he's done to us as well. Yeah, fuck that noise. You're getting pinned, boy. Ooh. We've got strangeness. We've got strangeness. And we are going... Oh, we got the health drink. Let's take... Ooh. This was the place that had loads of those... I can't remember what they're called now. Uh, the weird monkey people. That was good against them. Um... So, with that in mind, let's drop the gun for now. Oh, we're going to need the gun, though. Yeah, we're definitely sticking him. He is beyond irritating. I might go insane if I had him following us. We need a sword of obedience. Oh, it's actually classed as an other. It's not actually a weapon. That's kind of interesting. Uh, yeah, we'll keep that. My is oh we need come on we need something to get rid of that as well. Should we use a candle? Or should we use our necklace again? Honestly don't know like what the I don't know if it's best to use one of these. Or if it's best to use the candles. I don't know. Yeah man. Ooh. Oh, fuck. Fuck. We done broke another amulet, guys. Uh, these amulets are pretty crap, to be honest. In fact, these amulets are, I would go as far as saying shit. Um... Oh, you can't load the silver bullet up when you're here. You can take the drink, though. Okay. Ah, there's another red note. Hello. So, a scrap of red paper. Well, we better read that, son of a bitch. Continuing from yesterday, I'm going to summarize everything that I've learned about... Yeah. Naturally, it was a long way for a kid his age to travel. But he made the trip every week by subway or by bus. Unfortunately, someone else was living in his apartment, so he couldn't be reunited with his mother. Ah, for years he continued to come here almost like he was possessed. Just to peek into the apartment, eventually the tenants began to complain and treat him badly when they saw him hanging around. Walter began to fear the tenants and see them as obstacles, preventing him from seeing his mother. As the years passed and Walter matured, he began more and more influenced by the teachings of the cult. Furthermore, his obsession with mother and his feelings of resentment towards the outer world became even deeper. Walter became preoccupied with one particular tract from the cult's Bible, the descendants of the Holy Mother, the 21 sacraments. By the 21 sacraments, the Holy Mother shall appear in the countries of the world and shall bring salvation to the sinful ones. After Walter left the wish house, he moved to Pleasant River, a town neighboring Silent Hill. Pleasant River and Silent Hill. <laughs> For a while, he lived uh, the life of a normal student, but he was filled with bitterness and resentment towards the rest of the world. Several years later, he launched his plan there. The 21 Murders. Hmm. Okay. So I'm guessing, like, the victims were all members of this apartment because they were stopping him from getting back into the room which he thought he was his mother. Well, that's a, definitely a weebo bloody anime um, storyline if I've ever heard one. Okay, cool. But should we say it's definitely Japanese? 
It is about as far-fetched as it possibly gets. But, yeah, it's cool. I like. It makes sense. Well, no, it doesn't make sense at all. It's crazy, but it's entertainingly crazy. Yes. Right, let's go. Let's go, like... Why can't I... Okay, that's weird. Like, I'm not sure how we actually swap the, those bullets out. It seems to be, like, pure randomness, to be honest. I pushed um, uh, X, like, five times. That was weird. Okay, let's go take this guy down. Because I don't want him loitering around chasing us. That's even if we can take this guy down. Right. Ooh. I guess... I guess we can? Ooh. No. Right, let's leave you there, you bastard. Alright, that'll do. <laughs> There's something immensely satisfying about that. Yeah, otherwise I guess he's just gonna like chase us through this entire level. And fuck that noise. Alright, Eileen. Let's go. Oh. So where are we? We're in that elevator. Are you okay? I think so. Are you okay, Eileen? I mean, apart from the fact that you've been horribly murdered. Oh. Uh. That is a really weird fucking uh, layout of that menu. That's really weird. Uh, I guess... We're going to go bottom first, I suppose. Very rude. Ooh. Very rude of uh, Henry not... Ah, oh, that's on the other side. Of course it is. Very rude of Henry not to... Uh... Ooh. Respond. Yeah, we'll have the holy candle. Wait, is that all that's here? I guess so. Okay. Well that's, well, that's fine. I'm not going to complain. Can we go this way, though? Ah, we can. Sure, I guess. Ah, oh, bloody le Oh, yeah, of course. She can't go down, can she? So, we're on our own for this bit. Alright. Alright. Uh, see if we've got any other goodies in here. Alright, what have we got, Henry? What have we got, buddy? Can you see anything, pal? Can you see any goodies that we may want? Oh, there's something on the other side of that. Remember when we could just, like, walk through these with no shits given? Because we could just regen all of our health. I remember those days. They were good days. Now, what's that in the corner? A cue ball. What's a cue ball doing here, anyway? Uh, yeah, I guess we'll have it. Um, so, we've got this ladder we can go up. Ah, we're on the other side. Okay. Now, these doors, I'm guessing, are all going to be locked. Because they were in the, the first time we came around here. Fuck you. Fuck you and die. I'm not sure how we're going to get Eileen here. But I guess maybe we don't. You little prick, I saw you. Little fuck. That's also broken. Cool. 
The more broken doors, the better, I suppose. Ooh. Oh, ooh. Wait, yep, but they're the same person. <sighs> I'm going to see my mom. Stay out of my way. Who are you, anyway? My name's Walter. Walter Sullivan. It's time to complete the 21 sacraments. But that's my name. And what are the 21 sacraments? Don't worry. You'll know soon enough. Well, let's go and see Mother. Let me go, that hurts! It's weird, man. Like, damn. He's talking to himself as a kid, and I don't know. Um, oh, shit. Oh, it's bloody. What's the name? Maybe we should stick a. Ooh. Yeah, nice try. Oh, God. She's actually. Yeah, that actually was a nice try. Right, okay. Now she's down. Man, we're really going places. So, what have we got here? It's a weird place for a volleyball game. Alright, we'll take that. Volleyball. And a saint medallion. Uh, okay, so we're like filling up on items here. Pretty badly. Uh, we still don't have... Ooh. Oh, I don't know, man. We're leaving her like quite far back. I hope... I hope that's okay. <laughs> Please... Ooh, shit. We got wheelchairs. Oh, bollocks. Ouch. Yeah, that hurts. I mean, it's not super bad. Bloody hell. But it's bad enough. There's nothing else here, I don't think. Holy shit, I didn't like that much. Let's use that. Okay. Oh. I guess there's nothing there. Oh, I hope Eileen's okay. She should be. I wouldn't actually mind the way to go back home. Just to drop some of the stuff off. Yeah, because I'm guessing there's no real way of... Uh, taking... Oh yeah, these two were locked, weren't they? Locked. Locked. Okay. Ooh. There's a memo here. The boss said we had to change our phone number because of the complaints about the weird noises. Now we have to change the store sign on the roof. What a pain. By the way, the number is the last four digits of the new phone number. Not too smart if you ask me. The new phone number. Uh... Okay. It's a billiard table. Looks like they were in the middle of the game. Can we put this there? Oh. Wait. That's it? Um, okay, so... So how do we... Get the new phone number? I'm guessing... I'm guessing if we go back home, is the new phone number going to be... Um, out the window, possibly. And is Eileen going to be okay? I'm like really freaking out about that. Like, really don't want her to be tripping.
And on that note... Is there any weirdness going on in here? Might as well save the game whilst we've come back, I suppose. Um, fuck it, save it there, why not? Okay, uh, right, so what did we come back here for? Because we've got too much stuff, really. We don't need that. I don't think we need the handgun. Now, do I want to take the sword? Well, we've got two swords left, I think, haven't we? Yeah. No, we only got one. Hmm. Oh, we don't need that either. Um. I, mean, I guess we we'll take that. If we can stick Cynthia, that might be a good idea. Right. Uh. Okay. Cool. Uh. Let's go back. Oh shit! Twat. We went back for an actual reason, didn't we? We went back to look out of the window. And see if the number's been changed here. Which I'm guessing it is. I'm guessing it has. Right, 3750. No, that's the same number I've got here, 3750. Uh, that's a pain. So how do we... 3750. I'm guessing... Do we go to the roof somehow? Maybe. Maybe, yeah, because we're actually looking out into the real world, aren't we? Okay, well, we've put the billiard ball on the table. We've got a volleyball. I don't know where we're going to put that, but I'm sure we'll find somewhere for it. Then he mentioned a cat as well, so we've got to find a cat too. Um... Okay. Nothing there to pick up. That's cool. Yeah, I think it's just the uh, the water prison that I didn't like. There's something about that place. It's not that it was scary or anything. It was just the like maze-like structure of it. But it's not... I don't know. It's not really a, a maze, though. Maybe I'm just getting flashbacks of the water temple from Zelda. Fuck off. These wheelchairs actually do um, proximity damage, which is interesting. Right, okay. Let's hang on. Was there another door back there? No. No. No, I guess not. Alright, let's see if we can go stick Cynthia. Although, I'm not sure if we can. Oh! That's not Cynthia. But I guess... I guess, like, if we stick any of these ghosts, it'll be good. But we are taking damage. Proximity damage, which ain't great. Yeah, I don't know how... Some of them, maybe you can't stick. Because this guy... This guy's too quick. So, we're just going to get the fuck out of here. Yeah, he's, like, too fast. We can't stick him. Because he doesn't go down. There's Cynthia, but... Uh, nah, I don't know. I... I don't know if there's any point... In sticking them. Because they're easy enough to run past. As long as there's not, like, ridiculous amounts of them. Like, two's not too bad. And at least... Okay, so... The fuck? Oh, that's a leech. I was like, what the fuck is coming through the 
door or the wall there. What the fuck? But it's okay. Where the hell's Eileen? We leave her on the other side. Where is she? Um, oh, there she is. Nah, she looks fine. Okay. All right. Hairy muff. Let's go. So we're on the bottom. We started on the middle. Let's go to the top. See if we can see this sign from the top. I always feel bad, like, when I barge her out the way as well. It's, uh... It's not good. What is making that sound? Straight away, we've got a nasty, unpleasant sound. Ooh. Ooh. Whoa. Sniffers. Ooh, get off me. Okay, we haven't seen these for a little while, have we? That's quite cool. Oh, what the fuck was that? Nice stuff, Eileen. Squish! Right, sit down, you. What the hell was that roaring? I'm guessing that's just like ambient sound effects. Okay. Well, I guess we're gonna go upstairs. We haven't seen any of those monkeys yet. Uh, I think that's just like ambient sound effects. That ain't nothing to worry about. Ooh, got a bit of static. That's cool. Come on, Eileen. We haven't got all day. Uh, now, to take the drink or to not take the drink? Shit. Kind of left her behind. Ooh. Cake candles, that's weird. Yeah, it's a bit weird, but uh, we'll have them, I suppose. Uh, right, Eileen, let's go back and get her. We don't leave her on her own too long. Alright. So we've got cake candles. What the fuck do we use those for? Colourful candles for putting on a birthday cake. Cool, I guess. It's filled with volleyballs. Do we put... Put the volleyball in the basket. Okay. Yeah. Sure, we'll have that. Why not? They're all bent and broken. So, we've put the volleyball, like, back in the basket. That's just weird. Like... I mean, okay. Cool, I guess. Um... I mean, we can go back home. Which actually is a good idea, because we're out of time here now, guys. So, yeah, let's head back. We can jiggle our stuff around. We need to decide, like, if we actually want the gun. I don't know if we want the gun, to be honest. Kind of seems a little bit pointless at this point. So, let's go back. Let's see if anything's possessed. And when we come back... Hello? Any weird goings on? Yeah, I think we're good. Yeah, so we need to find out the... the code for the bar. I don't think we're going to need that either, really. We'll hold on to it, though. Not going to use that. Keep hold of that. Don't want the club. And my dog is like crying outside, which is a bit weird. Um, yeah, we'll hold on to that stuff for now. I don't know how much health we have. I don't know if there's a way of bringing your health up. Yeah, there is. Uh, we can drink that, I suppose. Why not? Yeah, so I'm going to save it. When we come back... 
We are going to continue, I guess. I'm not really sure where we're going to um, go next. I think we've got a few options. And we've still technically... I think we've still got some more rooms to search on the on the elevator as well. I think we've still got a whole floor yet. And then possibly another opposite door that we haven't gone through. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time. <laughs>